what's going on, it's hump day. I'm excited, you see the smile on my face, because I believe that today is going to be the best day of my life. Yeah, I know I said it last week, but every day I wake up, I say this will be the best day of my life, because I believe it, so therefore I'm going to do what needs to be done. The question is, do you believe that today will be the best day of your life, because you have the strength to be on the inside? I want to talk to you today about wisdom. In order to get to where you're supposed to be, you gotta have wisdom. But how do you get wisdom? You gotta get wisdom using the 60-40 communication rule. That's right, the 60 to 40 communication rule. I want you to listen 60% of the time, and then I want you to speak 40% of the time, or less. You heard what I said, or less. 60% of the time you are listening and then 40% of the time you are speaking. Cause see what happens when you talk too much and you begin to run your mouth about stuff you don't know nothing about, you cannot get wisdom. Take for instance a pillow. You take a pillow, a pillow has a lot of feathers inside. And if I take a pillow and I rip that pillow and I throw it up in the air, all the feathers begin to scatter all over the ground, all over the environment. Those feathers are like words. When you release those feathers, there's no way humanly possible you can go back and retrieve all those feathers. The same way when you speak without thinking, and when you speak without wisdom, you cannot go back and get those words that you have released from, that, from your mouth like a pillow. Those feathers are spread all over the world and you cannot retrieve them. So be careful what you say, be careful what, when, when you say it, and be careful how you say it. You have to begin to understand that conversation is dialogue, not monologue. I can sit in front of a, a window, sit in front of a mirror, and talk to myself all day long. But I have to listen not to hear, I have to listen to understand. Because it's not, it's not until I understand what you're saying that I can truly have a conversation with you. And when you begin to listen to your friend, to your mother, to your wife, to your husband, when you begin to listen to understand, then you can have a conversation and your relationship can grow. So you have to exercise 60% of the time, I'm going to listen to what you have to say, and then 40% of the time, I'm going to speak, and then my wisdom will slowly begin to grow. It's like a little baby. How, how does a baby learn to, 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 to be a man? How does a baby learn to be a woman? See, babies, when they can't talk, they're taking it in. They're walking around, there's a toddler. You take a toddler, for instance, a toddler can talk, but a toddler listens 60% of the time, and they only speak 40% of the time. So that toddler is taking in all the information. It's taking in its, its environment, and our toddler begins to learn how to be a man, learn how to become, become a woman because of the wisdom of the environment that it's surrounded by. So I want you to start acting like you're a toddler and begin to listen more and begin to speak less. You had a strength of beings on the inside. Let's get out.